What's new in the May edition of Pixel Experience ROM running on the Redmi K20 Pro or the Xiaomi Mi 90 Pro? Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you what is new in the May update of Pixel Experience ROM running on the Redmi K20 Pro or the Xiaomi Mi 90 Pro. As you can see, I am running the Plus Edition on my Redmi K20 Pro and the changes are the same for the normal edition as well. Right off the bat, you will notice that the security patch has been updated to May of 5th, 2020 and the kernel version is Fixie 0.19. Next up, they have fixed the rounded corners, so the corners should be even more better. And they have also updated ANX camera. We can open the camera application and have a look at all the modes which we have. So we have slow motion, then you have short video, video, photo mode, 48 megapixel mode, portrait mode, night mode, panorama, and pro mode. So these are all the modes which are available in ANX camera, which comes baked in with Pixel Experience ROM running on the Redmi K20 Pro. Then they have also fixed the random lags which you would get in the screen recorder application in case you use screen recorder application i do not see the option for recording internal audio yet i guess they are still working on that and you should have that option pretty soon but it's not available in the current build then they have also fixed the flickers which you would get in android auto and wi-fi display unfortunately i do not have any of those devices to test out those features but as per the change log, those flickers have been fixed along with the random crashes which you would get in the settings application. Those have also been fixed. Next up, they have also improved long screenshot. Here it is, three finger screenshot. Tap on long screenshot once, it will scroll down. One more time, it will scroll till the end and then I can just dismiss it and the screenshot will be saved. Then good news, face unlock is still there. So we can go into settings, security, Make sure you have set up a pin, tap on face unlock, enter your current pin and once that is done, you can set up your face unlock. It is going to give you some information about face unlock. Click on next and bam, there it is. You can see that the camera just popped up and it is trying to read my face data but my face is not there right now and let me align my face and set up face unlock real quick. And once you have set up face unlock, you do have the option to bypass the lock screen wherein pressing the power key will open the home screen or the last used app once a face is matched. Click on done and bam, there it is. Face unlock has been set up and it works absolutely fine, super fast, along with the in display fingerprint scanner, which is also super fast in this build. So, in short, this Pixel Experience May Edition build on the Redmi K20 Pro is more of a bug fix build and there aren't many new features which have been added so there it is peeps that was our first look at pixel experience may edition rom running on the redmi k20 pro or the xiaomi mi 90 pro and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you